We are incredibly blessed to be surrounded by family and friends and to be together to celebrate Mary Grace and Seamus's marriage start. Trish and I are thrilled that there is so much love in the room. Jimmy, Antoinette, Mom, and I look forward to watching you both live a full life, welcoming children, and inspiring all you meet to be the best versions of themselves. I'm not going anywhere. I can't help to know Mary Grace is to love Mary Grace. And because everyone knows her, it follows that everyone loves her. Mary Grace radiates a confidence and warmth that people just want to be around. She is able to be everyone's friend while also being so uniquely herself. Mary Grace has been sure of herself since the day she was born. Over the years, I have come to learn that the most important friend you can have is someone who excels at being the type of person that you want to be. I'm not going anywhere. And luckily for my friendship with Seamus, he's the type of person that we all want to be. He's wildly adventurous, overwhelmingly confident. Seamus is really what most of us think of when we think of the American dream, and I couldn't be more proud of him. As a friend, Seamus will be there for you no matter what. That's about the best catch-all that I can give for the kind of person Seamus is. Seamus, as the oldest of the family, I've always felt a responsibility for my younger siblings especially my sisters. And I know that Mary Grace is in great hands with you as her husband, partner, and best friend. When the sun's on the path, sinking low, I'll strike a light. And I'm so excited to welcome you to the family as our brother. I'm not going anywhere. It comes as no surprise that as your younger sister, I have looked up to you all my life as well. Mary Grace, you are the best sister and friend I could ever ask for. And I am so honored to have been by your side today as you married Seamus. When I was thinking about all the stories and memories and moments we've shared as sisters, I realized that actually your initials encompass it all. MG, you are my gift. Your selflessness, humor, kindness, clumsiness, guidance, and wisdom have been a gift to me since forever, and I am so grateful. I can't imagine having grown up and going through life without you. Know that I hold all of your advice and our countless laughs throughout the years very close to my heart. MG, for so many reasons, you are my gift. And I know Seamus sees, values, and loves you as a gift too. Oh, wow. Today, you are no longer just mom and dad's little Mary Grace. You are now Mary Grace McCaffrey. You make a great couple. When I handed Mary Grace off at the altar, I gave Mary Grace a hug and I said, you're going to be great. It's going to be a great day. Enjoy this day. And I love you. And then I gave you a hug. And I said, I need you to take care of her. And he said, I would give my life for her. So take much. care of her? I sure will. I'd give my life for her. Mary Grace is now gaining a strong, devout, Christ-filled gentleman in Seamus who loves her with his whole heart and she will be just fine. I, Seamus, take you, Mary Grace, 
to be my wife. I, Mary Grace, take you, Seamus, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. After Mary Grace and Seamus' first date, Mary Grace called mom and said, Mom, I think I'm in love. <laughs> Flash forward a year and a half later and here we are on your wedding day. Let's all raise our glasses and wish Seamus and Mary Grace all the best as our pilot and his new bride take off on their long journey. Cheers! I present to you Mr. and Mrs. McCaffrey. <laughs>